Hi guys! Can we start off by singing Hello Neighbor? You remember that song? You ready? You ready? Okay, here we go, all together, okay? Hello neighbor, hello neighbor, what do you say? What do you say? It's going to be a beautiful day, it's going to be a beautiful day. Let's clap hands. Kanye, you clapping? Let's clap hands. Can we do it one more time? Hello neighbor, hello neighbor, what do you say? What do you say? It's going to be a beautiful day. It's going to be a beautiful day. Let's clap hands. Let's clap hands. Excellent. Now, let's sing the rest of the song. Do you remember it? Okay, I'm going to read it for you one time so that you can just remember. Okay, are you ready? Let's do it for you, okay? Hello, neighbor. Hello, neighbor. What? What do you say? What do you say? It's going to be a beautiful day. It's going to be a beautiful day. Let's clap hands. Let's clap hands. Hello, neighbor. Hello, neighbor. How do you do? How do you do? It's going to be a beautiful day. It's going to be a beautiful day. Now stomp your feet. Now stomp your feet. Hello, neighbor. Hello, neighbor. How do you do? How do you do? It's going to be a beautiful day. It's going to be a beautiful day. Jump up and down. Jump up and down. Last one, are you ready? Hello, neighbor. Hello, neighbor. What do you say? How do you do? It's going to be a beautiful day. It's going to be a beautiful day. And have a seat. Have a seat. Good job. Are you all sitting down? Okay. Can I see everybody put on your elephant? Yes. Good owl eyes and bubble mouth. Good job. Okay, today we are going to learn all about. Let me show you. Are you ready? What's this? Can you tell me what is this? This is a lizard. That's what we're learning about today. So, is a lizard an amphibian or is it a reptile? You tell me. It's a reptile. Why is it a reptile? Because it's cold-blooded. So remember what that means. That means he can't heat up his own body. He has to rely on the sun and the outside weather and the rocks around him. He has to try and find ways outside to make himself feel warm he can't his body doesn't do it by itself so what else makes him a reptile he has scales on his body and his skin is dry and his babies are born in eggs you're so clever you remember everything okay so let's look at his body he has a long tail Show me your tail. Good job. He has, how many eyes does he have? Can you count for me today? Two, one, two, one, two. How many nostrils does he have? One, two, one, two. And he has a little body. And he's got how many feet? Can you count his feet? One, two, three, four. He has four feet. Good. And his feet are almost like a frog. So they go out a little bit like that, so that they're a bit sticky and they help him to grab on so he can climb and catch his food. Can you tell me what's special about a lizard? Do you know? If a lizard is scared and another animal is chasing him, he can let his tail come off 
So the animal thinks he caught him. Meantime, he's already run away and his tail will grow back. He will grow another tail. That's so cool, hey? So let's see what else I can tell you about a lizard. But before I do that, let's see what you can remember. Okay, so a lizard is a, is it an amphibian or a reptile? A reptile. He has cold blood. Okay, he's cold blooded. So what does that mean? Can he make his own body warm? No, he can't. His body doesn't do it by itself. So, and where are his kids born? His babies are born in eggs. Good. And the lizard is a reptile, so that means he breathes air. Air. He lives on land. So what does he eat? He eats smaller bugs than him. Insects and bugs. And little worms. And what can you tell me about a lizard's tongue? Have you seen a, lizard, a lizard's tongue? It looks like a snake's tongue. It's got a little one like this and it goes and he grabs it. He's got a little tongue and little serrated teeth. So what's special about a lizard that I told you? Think about his tail. What does he do with his tail? His tail can come off. Then he can grow a new tail. He's so cool. Or is it small or big? You get some very big lizards and you get some very little lizards. Let's see what else we can see about lizards. Are you ready? Okay, let's have a look. There you can see the lizard's skin. Can you see it's very scaly and it's very dry, just like the crocodile. Can you see his thin little hands? He's got sharp little claws. This helps him to dig into the ground when he's walking and it helps him to catch his food. Let's see what else. Ooh, look at him. He's laying in the sun. Why is he doing that? Because he's cold blooded and his body can't get warm by itself. So he's laying in the sun so he can get some warmth. Look at his tongue, a long tongue. Just like a snake, can you see it goes like that? It goes up and down. See, up and down. Just like a snake's tongue, and it's also very long. Where do lizards live? Can you tell me? Lizards live normally in the little rocks or in the sand. They make a little nest and they lay little eggs with their babies in it. So now you know all about lizards. There's not much more to know. They can run around. They eat insects that are smaller than them. Their tails come off. They lay eggs and they look after the eggs. They have little claws to help them crawl and to help them catch their food. And what do they do when they're very scared? Their tail comes off and they grow a new tail. Are you going to remember all of this? Good job. You guys are so clever, hey? You make me so proud. Okay, guys, I'll be back. Have a great day and do lots of fun learning, okay? Remember to go to the party. No more nappies, big boys and girls. Bye.